We're talking about auto accidents, crashes, okay? We're also talking about personal injuries, slips and falls, other things that happen to us, possibly even uh, an accident at the workplace, okay? What I do as a chiropractor is I check how that spine is working and how it's functioning, because that houses the spinal cord, okay? All those nerves that come out, that go to all the different parts of our body to have the communication, that's what we're looking at, okay? Coming in and getting checked is very simple, very easy, very quick, okay? We wanna make sure that that spine is moving like it's supposed to, that the biomechanics are functioning and working like they're supposed to. We don't have tight junctions in that spine. We don't have tight muscles or ligaments and things of that nature, okay? Especially after some sort of accident or trauma, okay? Um, as also a functional neurologist, I've been extensively trained in how the brain's working, okay? How those pathways, specifically in the brain that go out to the rest of the body, are functioning and how they need to, to work, okay? So coming in, very simple, very quick, and we don't need to worry um, if that's gonna affect the rates of your insurance because by law, they're not allowed to. So coming in, getting checked to make sure you're doing okay, or at least coming up with a plan to help us get better, it's your right as a patient to be able to have that service, and that's where I come in. So coming in, checking out how that neck's doing, specifically the neck, the reason why is because all of the blood flow that goes up to the brain runs right through the neck. So we wanna make sure that that neck is aligned as, as um, precise as possible so our brain, okay, up in here, can get the blood flow that it needs, that the flow of uh, the cerebral spinal fluids open and everything is functioning like it's supposed to. We look down at that lower neck, that's where we get um, upper arms and hands, okay? So we get those numbness and tingling, that weakness in the arms and the hands, that's also coming from that lower neck. So we gotta make sure that is functioning like it's supposed to. Okay, we work through that mid back, okay? With that tight between the shoulder blades. That's where a lot of our organ functions are coming out of through that spinal cord. And then specifically in that lower back, that lumbar spine, that's where we get the legs, okay? We get that sciatic pain that shoots down the leg, okay? A lot of that comes down from L4, L5, S1. We need to make sure that as well is doing everything that's supposed to, okay? The other part, checking for those TBIs, checking for that possible concussion, okay? Because we don't want that post-concussive syndrome or that dreaded second hit syndrome, okay? So what I'm looking for is I'm checking specific eye movements, okay? I'm checking specific um, balancing issues, okay? We're also looking at specific um, functional neurological pathways and make sure that they're right where they need to be because that's how life is. That's what, that's what our brain's trying to do, is understand the world around us. And if the signals coming in are all different and um, uncoordinated and not making any sense, the brain doesn't know what to do. And so then it prolongs these inflammatory states and all these other types of things. So coming in, getting our spine checked, getting our brain checked after a, an injury, after a crash or anything like that is ideal. The quicker we get to it, the better results we see. And again, with everything, healing takes time. So we need to make sure we find the right plan. And if it by chance isn't with us, we will find somebody who is needed, whether that's a, another um, orthopedics surgeon or a dentist, if we knock some teeth out or we have jaw issues, if it's a neurologist on these other aspects that we need to bring in, we will bring them in because we need to make sure that you are getting the help you need, okay? so. Coming in, getting our spine checked after an injury, super simple, super easy, super quick, one of the best things you can do after a car crash, okay? So keep that spine and that brain in mind, especially after a crash, and come on in and see us.